Hi there, my name is Sam, and I'd like to welcome you to the Real-Time Cloud Services family, where we believe in empowering business through technology. This is going to be our first tutorial on how to connect to the server. The first thing you're going to be notice is you're going to get an email, and the email will look something like this. This is the email body. It'll say, it'll be, it'll be greeted with your name. Afterwards, you're going to see your server name over here, and then you're going to have a, your username for your server along with your password. The first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to download the RDP. That is short for Remote Desktop Connection. Click on Download here and it'll download immediately to the Downloads folder. Well, for, e for easier purposes, it, we're going to save this file in on the desktop. So we're going to go here, going to cut it, and we're going to minimize everything here and paste it on our desktop. Let's just drag this over here. And once we've got this pasted on our desktop, you will be already, you're already halfway done. All we need to do is click this icon and it'll take us straight to the server. We're gonna double click it right now. You're gonna get a pop-up message here of unknown publisher. What you can do is you can check this checkbox right here and this will omit this message from appearing again. So let's just for this purpose, for this tutorial's purpose, we're not gonna be clicking on this checkbox. So we're gonna click on continue and you're gonna get prompted for your password. So the password is available on your email like I showed you earlier, you type in the password and you're going to get another pop-up and that is the security certificate pop-up. What you want to do here is you want to check this box here, don't show me again, and then click on yes. For this tutorial's purpose, we're not going to check this checkbox. We're going to click on yes and you're going to be connected to the server. As our server is coming up, you'll be able to see what programs are loaded on the server and how easy it is to work from our servers. So there you go, the server is already loaded up and this is your server session. As you can see, you have the applications installed here and you can work and save all your data on the cloud server. Now we're gonna log out from here and click on start and then click on log off. And once we've logged off, we're back on our normal desktop screen and this concludes our first tutorial on how to connect to the server. Thank you very much for being a part of Real-Time Cloud Services. Have a great day.